With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we are going to see this question. The question says that the moment of inertia of a body about its axis is 1.2 kilogram meter square. Initially, the body is at rest. In order to produce the rotational kinetic energy of 1500 joules, an angular acceleration of 25 radians per second square must be applied about the axis for the duration of what? Okay, so we need to find the time for which this angular acceleration must be applied. So firstly, what we'll do basically, we are gonna have to find the means uh, rotational kinetic energy. Kinetic energy is basically equal to I omega square by two. Okay, this is basically the rotational kinetic energy, and basically this is for uh, this omega is basically final uh, final velocity means angular velocity produced so what we are going to write since angular means i is basically everything is given in the question kinetic energy is 1500 so 1500 okay will be equal to this i omega square i is given 1.2 into omega omega is over here given 20 uh, not given over here so we'll just leave it as omega square divided by 2 okay so what we are going to get from here omega square will be equal to 1500 basically 3000 3000 divided by 1.2 okay this we are going to get it as we'll get it the value of omega will be equal to 50 okay so this is what we get omega so we'll keep this aside for a while so now we are going to use equations of motion okay equations of motion basically rotational motion rotational motion so what is the basically equation of rotational motion we are going to use firstly everything was given in the question so once we'll see omega naught which is initial velocity uh, initial angular velocity was zero omega was found to be 50 basically t need to we need to find and basically acceleration alpha is given as around uh, 25 radians per second square okay 25 radians per second square okay so basically this is the thing so now what we're gonna do we are gonna use the first equation of mo uh, rotational motion which is omega is equal to omega naught plus alpha into t okay so uh, everything over here we know except t so 50 will be equal to 0 plus alpha will be equal to 25 into t so the value of t will come out to be 2 seconds okay so we got that the value of t was found to be 2 seconds and hence our answer is option number b thank you for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.